Okay. Should we crack it off with Liverpool, Manchester? As in, like, the 40 team or just, like, no, the cities just the in general? the cities, because you're from Liverpool, but I, you I don't live wanna, in Manchester. Yeah, I don't want to give any Manchester slam there, but um, the feel is better. Would you ever move back? I feel like I've had a social life in Liverpool 100%, but I've got no mates. Whoa! <laughs> Sorry about it. No, really Sorry. Sure. I think I'm going to have to say, it depends where the band is as well, but I think I might have to say Imani. Yeah, Unless so, I just, like... You can't slander yeah. anymore, then. No, <laughs> No, I have more fun in Manchester, but you, you just don't understand. Liverpool Night Out is silly. It is actually elite. I, have I, do in, I have been on a night, I've been on a few night outs out in Liverpool, and I'm, I do approve. Yeah. I do very much approve. Um, now, you are a bit hashtag viral on the old TikTok. No, no. No, but yeah. You've, uh, you've even made a TikTok saying you accidentally became an influencer. You no, know, because TikTok only wants me to be viral if it's not to do with music. Like, TikTok doesn't even know I do music. Any music video. Oh, just spray uh. it. Sorry, say it, don't spray it. I'm telling you, every time I do anything to do with music, TikTok wants to, like, shadow ban me or something. But as, as long as I'm chatting shit, yeah, so, TikTok loves it. So, you said that you, like, started TikTok for, for music. music. Yeah. <laughs> I, I but when I tell you I've been doing TikTok for, like, two years straight only music and it did like it did awful and then as soon as i started talking it's just like it's actually doing sound well it, it's part of the brand now yeah, it's guess. part of the brand yeah, I guess. um you have no music on streaming platforms no, no. when are we gonna get some um i'm very lazy i'm so lazy no because i actually really want to and every time like i try and get any recorders i'm just not happy with it and like it's all getting the band together, and I feel like I write loads of music as well. And like, I'll, I'll be like writing the next new song, and I'm like, oh my god, let's write another song, let's write another song. I so really your red recorded. flag as Olivia De Ferreira. Oh, dear Ferreira. Dear Ferreira. Go. What is it? Dear Ferreira. We've had diarrhea. I've had diarrhea. I've had diarrhea. Ferreira. Are you still called Olivia Diarrhea? I don't think let's make that a thing. Let's not make that a thing. Um, but your red flag is that you don't <laughs> you don't finish music or you don't yeah, release don't music know. or you make new music too quickly yeah like uh, before i record anything i'll like write a new song and then i'm like oh my god this is so much better the next big like i'm just chasing the next big thing i know i really do need to get stuff recorded but as well i think it's scary recording stuff because it's like this is the final product do you yeah. know what i mean like i know i want to be 100 percent happy with stuff and plus like i only really started writing music literally last year and i've you know kind of getting yeah. it set together getting it sorted and like then tiktok's just taking up all my goddamn time but i think next year i actually want to get like you want to sort it out sort it out mate sort it, sort it out. out okay let me look at my questions okay i've also seen on your tiktok that you um hashtag love a night out yeah i, I think i love a night out a bit why too much. Why don't you make like some like no, don't dance, dance music? music. No, I'm not. I'm not trying to do dance music. I'm sorry. Ever? No, because I don't like dance music anyway. Well, I do. I do. I'm not trying to slander the dance music, but I only like French house. I'm very, very. That's specific. so niche. <laughs> That's That's so niche. niche. No, no, no. But like, lady, hear me. Yeah. Too. Like, oh, no, I do like. No, I do. Um, I feel like that's just not me. That's just not me. Okay. I love dancing to dance music, but I don't really think I'm the vibe for dance music. Okay. I had to make dance music for one of the uni assignments, and I did very much enjoy it. But I feel like I don't know. I've just got a really diverse music taste, <gasps> and I'm just like can't put me in a box. But yeah, no, I feel like maybe I should. At um, we we had a little previous random street interview when we first met. We did, yeah. We didn't like, I and mean, we just we met in the loos again yeah. at night and day, and we're like, holy guacamole! It's, it's you. you. <laughs> um, but I remember asking you to do the fit check, and pretty much everything was bare necessities. Yeah. And you have now recorded yeah. in bare necessities. In I know. bare necessities. I, know. I was like, bro, this is a full circle. It is. No, because, like, I went there that often and then, like, literally spent all my money in there and then I used to just go, because now I've spent, like, all my money in there and I, I thought, you know what, fuck it, I'm just going to go in to chat to the staff. So I just go in and chat shit to the girls for, like, two hours. Like, I'll be in there, but, oh, my God, that's just... No, 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 no. And then, yeah, so, like, I've been befriended by the Ben Sessie staff and then I was like, pretty, pretty, please. Um, pretty, pretty, and then, please. Yeah. And they let you. Yeah. yeah. That's what happens that when you were regular. Regulars get rewards. <laughs> <laughs> and you also said that your favourite song was Freckles by Hesha. Um, yeah. <laughs> Is it doing your favourite? Um, uh, I 
ever got to say like a legit favorite song at the Met? Yeah. Oh. Oh. See, it's so tough. Okay. At the mini, it's a little toss up. Um. At the mini, I'm gonna say. Empty and Silence by Mount Kimbe featuring uh, King Cruel. And it's so sad because a man put me onto that song. And I hate that shit. But yeah. Yeah. Judgment. I do, I do get the pair sound to chase off men, but it's okay, it's okay. <gasps> We're I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna pretend that I like fans. I it think myself. that's like. Not even like a guilty pleasure, like it's a guilty personality trait, but like. Yeah, I can't help it. <laughs> what's I the, can't what's help the most embarrassing thing you've ever done, like for a boy? I don't know, you know, because I'm like permanently single. I mean, like in high well, school, no, for, not for the boy, but I mean, like I in high school, I had the biggest, like I've had, I had the biggest crush on this boy, mm -hmm. and I mean, like, see if I didn't see this boy in the corridor, like my day would be ribbons, <laughs> like funny ribbons, and what else? I don't know. We used to shout his name, like the whole of my secondary school. It was common knowledge towards like everyone. Everyone knew. Everybody knows. Everybody. He knows. knew as well. Uh, no, he knew. Everyone knew. <laughs> I can't give anything to myself, like genuine, I crave dopamine, so I like, if I didn't tell people about my crush, like what? Yeah, you can't talk about your crush, like that's the point of a crush. I need to chat shit somehow, like I'm not trying to chat shit about anyone else, so I was like, I'll just chat shit about but myself. myself. Yeah, I mean, the whole school knew, everyone knew, you joking, we made a group chat, added them all into it. Oh! I've said too much. Trauma is being it's really, really dug up. Honestly, I really want to forget. That was like the worst point. That was the worst That was a low blow. That was a low Mine, point. mine, I'll bait myself out as well to, in solidarity. Yeah. Um, I pretended I liked pop smoke. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, the amount of fans that I've adopted yeah. because of men. So I, he like religiously listened to pop smoke and I was like, same. And whenever I would drive him and his mates, I had a specific playlist that I'd put on. And I'm like, yeah, that's just my driving playlist. And it was I fucking love not. this song. No, no, I used to analyze like the shit that you put on your stories, like, and I'd be like, oh, I love this song. Or like you'd put something on your story yeah, with a song that they done, and be like, ah! Yeah, we've been there, we've yeah. been there. Um, you are also a hashtag barista. Yeah. yeah. What is? What's your favorite coffee drink? Sorry. <laughs> what's your What's your go-to coffee? And also, what's your favorite coffee to make? Okay, I actually don't drink coffee. <gasps> um, ooh, Holy but, but I mean, I do not. Well, I, I do not. I didn't when I started, but now I do. I guess. I mean, yeah. I have honey oat ice latte, but I, when I'm telling you, honey, you, you have honey syrup, oat milk, honey oh, syrup. Oh, I've never no, tried that. Oh, it's unreal. Okay, Cabernero, have Cabernero. to have to come visit. But I mean, I have like half a shot. I'm not trying to coffee. Yeah. Me on coffee? Are you joking? Yeah, I think no, that would be something else. No, it's not a good else. combination no. at all. No. What's your favourite to make? Um, flat white. Flat white. I enjoy making. I, I, I've done a little little leaf today. I'll show you. Oh, can you do that? Yeah. <laughs> I had a little leave, but then I was like, I'm gonna say, let me get, let me get a pick. Let me get a pick. Yeah. Um, we went to the final ever footage karaoke together we the other week. What's your go-to karaoke song? Oh. Well, that on that final night, I really wanted to do "I Wish" by Skilo, like so bad, because I didn't have a go-to. I do mix it up, but I wanted to be like, "Oh, she was a little bit tall," and then he didn't have it, and I was fuming. So I ended up doing "Never Too Much" by Luther Vandross. But then I went on the Liverpool night out. Couple of days later, and then I sang. And you did it. I got to do oh, it. Oh, there we go. That's why you prefer Liverpool over Manchester. Yeah. I get it. I understand. Um, who do you think is going to win the Euros? Oh, babe, don't ask me that. I don't follow Footy one bit. Like, I actually, I do. Just name who, a European country. Oh, shit. Um, Italy? Question mark. Yeah, Italy. Okay. I don't know. I don't follow Footy one bit. My twenty-five percent Italian blood. Italy. Ah! I don't know if they're not going to... I don't okay. know. Who, who actually is going to win? Do you know who's going to win? Who's good? Well, I'm back who's... in the England, Am boys. I supposed to say England? You, you're not supposed really, to. Yeah. But England are playing today. No, I've got to think about realistically who's going to win now. Or France, who... maybe. France. France or Portugal. Okay, yeah. I think maybe France. France. Yeah. I enjoy France. I'm also... I'm, I've got my little 25% French, 25%. Okay. Yeah, I'm clinging on. What's it? What's it? What's it? A Liverpool slogan that I should learn. Oh. I know that heavy salad. I don't even know that bit. I'm, not, I'm a fake scouter. He I'm a fake oh. scouter. I can't. Uh, smell your mouth. I love saying smell your mouth always. Is that just like a your mum No, thing? but no one even says it. I just say because I'm weird. <laughs> <laughs> smell your mouth. I'm like, schnud, smell your mouth. But I don't even, Oh, actually, no. Actually, that's so gross. I'm not going to even tell you what it means. No, tell me. I actually... <laughs> 
You can't, I can't. I can't even tell you what it means. Urban Dictionary. It's actually gross. It, that's what, like, it, when you're in the playground, the lads are close, yeah, and you go like that, and you go, smell your mouth. <laughs> What's your thoughts on the upcoming general election? Jenny Lech. I wish yeah. Jeremy Corbyn was up, yeah. still up running. Same. I literally am not asked. I mean, My as, long, as long as Labour win, but I don't even... I'm not really asked. Like, I don't yeah. think La Labour's not even Labour no more. Labour's literally Tory. But as long as it's not the Tories, I'm happy. Yeah. So real. Um, what's the best gig you've ever gone to? <gasps> Mount Kimbay. This, this, yeah. is, this is the band that I said. Because I went a little solo gig. I went by myself the other week. Oh, yeah, of It course. was so good. Like, cause Are you going to go to more solo gigs? Oh, oh, well, I booked a solo gig and I was really excited to go. Yeah. And then events of booking a holiday at the same time. So I <laughs> bought holiday of gig. But no, it was so good because like, I literally booked it like a couple of days before. And then it rocked up. And then I ended up going to this like squatter's rave afterwards. And it was just boss. And then I made like loads oh, of friends. That's and so then I saw my, And then I saw my Cafe Nero crush there as well. <gasps> Is this Cafe Nero crush someone you work with or someone who comes in? No, someone who comes Well, he doesn't come in no more. Oh, I can't yeah. shoot your shot anymore. No, I need would to Would you ever? Would around. you ever? Would I ever shoot my shot? Would yeah. you that guy? Yeah. No, it's long gone. Long no, but like, if he gone. came, if he came if he in, in ordered a flat white, would you write oh your number God, on it? Oh, he gets flat white. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Because basically, basically, we matched on Hinge, we matched <gasps> on Hinge, and then the day after we matched on Hinge, it came in Cafe Nero. Oh my god. Isn't that it's mental? A sign. So I was thinking it was a sign, but I didn't yeah. think he thought it was a sign. And then I was talking about the gig, so I was like, oh, boy, bad. Okay. No, I know, I always loved having um, crushes at gigs. I, I, I love having crushes at any occasion. Like, yeah. I need to have a crush at any because it gives me motivation to. I love, like, when you're at a gig and you're like, yum. Yeah, the yeah. demographic. I enjoyed. Yeah. yeah, very good. Yeah. And so I got you a little present because it's your first festival performance. Oh my god! And I wanted to get you something like coffee based, but I obviously left it till this morning. Oh, it's really fine. So I just got you some flowers. Oh! And like I know they're like not like flowery, but it means they'll last longer. Oh my god! Because no they'll love. bloom. Oh my god! I and enjoy I put some stickers oh. on. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Says. Oh yeah. Is that like, I feel like Morrissey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, but do, yeah. I, do I carry it on stage? Just be like. Yeah, this is mine. Thank you. Oh, yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, so they'll bloom. These no, these are gonna fucking hit, <laughs> dry up in my room. My room's well. a shit hole. Oh. So mine, like, but flowers always make everything yeah, better. Yeah, you know, you're so right. I'm gonna have to like clear away all my like empty meal deal packets and yeah. front and center. Oh what yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Bye, I love you. I've just exposed myself so much in this video. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't it's know. It's got to be done.